One and a half hour dream, exactly, not mine, but uh, mine and uh, my uh, wife Magdalena, uh, was the traveling around the world. <laughs> So we calculated how many years we have to the end of the life, then divided by the quantity of the continents, then by countries and of course Poland where we are from. And at the end being four or five countries per continent when we will have the snow vacation. So we decide to build the truck, then uh, we decide to sell the house, sell the cars, uh, change the work for the remote because I'm working by the internet and after that we decide to go and that was the most important decision in my life because uh, it's very important to understand the country and you understand the country when you're not hurry not hurry from the tour one touristic point to the second touristic point Because of the rigid frame and the suspension. And with the rigid frame you don't need to use any pivot points for the container. And uh, it makes and, and uh, based on the YouTube exactly movies because I bought it and I never seen it. First after what I seen was my <laughs> yeah and uh, based on the YouTube movies um, we decide that uh, it will be perfect solution for us because without pivot points you can have 25 km per hour on the off-road and very comfortable and um, also on the traverses uh, the, the container is not dancing it's very stable everything is everything is on the on the chassis so on the suspension so that will, was uh, main reason, and the second reason that uh, I don't want to have Mercedes of MIN, <laughs> like yeah, sure. all of all, all of uh, all of overlanders do. They they they're buying the, the the German trucks, but of course the the Italians are driving by Iveco and the French by Renault. But Tatra it's uh, very unique. So and uh, Tatra. Uh, when somebody thinking about the Tatra, thinking about the uh, off-road compatibilities and uh, all of, uh, you know, it is hard truck, it's hard truck. And I spent a lot of time in the internet and I'm asking maybe every driver in Poland for the construction and a contact with the Polish dealer Vanitski and con uh, I'm contacted with the Tatra uh, factory as, as well and uh, at the end I have home on the Tatra so I'm very proud and the second thing what is important what uh, Czech uh, audience of the Tatra and Tatra fans don't like he have a Packard engine and because of that and ZF uh, gearbox I have service everywhere because of the Peterbilt and Kenworth truck in the Americas and the DAF in Tatra is in Australia, also in Asia is DAF so, and Tatra uh, uh, guarantee the uh, part availability parts availability in every continent so it's great for, for, the, for the overlanders it's enough <laughs> 